In this video, we will open a sample company and explore various features of QBO. Intuit has provided a sample company online to provide new users a test drive of its QBO product. Open your internet browser. Type https colon forward slash forward slash qbo dot intuit dot com forward slash r e d i r forward slash test drive into your browser's address text box and then press enter to view the sample company homepage. You may be asked to provide security information before proceeding. If so, type the words provided into the text box and click continue. Let's first explore sales, expenses, and employees information using the left navigation pane or bar. In this section, we will open the sales section in a new tab, find customers, and drill down to a specific customer and a specific transaction related to that customer. To access the customer's information, right-click Sales from the navigation pane and select Open Link in New Tab. Click on Customers from the top navigation bar. Note that the dates on this video will not match the dates that appear on your screen. As you can see, we have various customers and their information in this window. The money bar on the top of the screen shows important sales activity for customers under the headings Unbilled, Unpaid, and Paid. Below the money bar is a list of customers. Next, let's view the detailed transactions of a customer. Click on the text Amy's Bird Sanctuary to view the sales transactions related to Amy's Bird Sanctuary. Here we can see various types of transactions for Amy's Bird Sanctuary. The overdue balance $239.00 noted at the top right of the window correlates to the invoice 1021 shown near the bottom of the transaction list. Close this tab. Next, let's open the Expenses section in a new tab. Find vendors and drill down to a specific vendor and specific transactions related to that vendor. Right-click Expenses from the navigation bar and select Open Link in New Tab. The resulting action will add a new tab to your browser. Click on the new Expense Transactions tab and then on Vendors from the top navigation bar to reveal a vendor listing. Note the money bar on the top of the screen which shows important information related to expenditures under the headings Unbilled, Unpaid, and paid. From this list of vendors shown on the screen, click on the text Brosnahan Insurance Agency to view detailed transactions related to that particular vendor. Here we see that $241.23 is overdue against the category of insurance. Double click on the $241.23 balance to view the bill received. The $241.23 overdue balance correlates to a bill received from an earlier month and states that we have to pay an amount of $241.23 to Brosnahan Insurance Agency. Close this tab by clicking on the X at the top right corner of the screen. Now, let's open the Employees section in a new tab to view a specific employee and specific transactions related to that employee. To start, Right-click Employees from the navigation bar and select Open Link in New Tab. The resulting action will add a new tab to your browser. Click on the New Employees tab to reveal an employee listing. From the list of employees, click on the text Edit under Action for John Johnson to view employee information for John Johnson. Here, you can either edit John's information and click Save or you can just click Cancel on the lower left corner to close this window. Close this tab. Finally, to sign out of QBO, click the gear icon and click Sign Out to close the sample company. This completes our demonstration of viewing the sample company looking at sales, expenses, and employee information.